Hi, professor. This is Yamila. I'm doing my second thought prompt. The one I chose for this week is letter D, corporal punishment. The first question that is on there is, what are your views on spanking children, aka corporal punishment? So, my views on it is that I don't agree um, with it. I, don't, I think that low-key is kind of like a form of child abuse. And it's not the right way to be treating your children. I think there's other ways that you can show your children right from wrong or telling them to stop there's another way to like get to that point like make that point to your children it's kind of to me i know it's asking about children but it's kind of like a dog you know that um it's not like it'll the children will stop in the moment whatever you're trying to like whatever you're spanking them about but they might like they can't help it like they're not gonna like embed that into their memory hence why people continue to spank their children and then it's like kind of like a fear thing you know um what are the pros and cons to it to the pros not to me if any is that it'll, like i said it'll stop in the moment um they're like okay like I'm done, I don't want to get hit anymore, or they start crying, and then, more than likely, like, they'll get spanked, because they started crying for getting spanked, so I guess it's kind of like a con, I think there's just cons about it, to be honest, um, another con, like, I would say is that it's not the right way to instill discipline into the children, I think that, like I said, it was, it's gonna cause fear, and then again um i think at some point or at some age the child is gonna um process that getting spanked is only gonna hurt in the moment and whatever they want to do like they're gonna want to continue to do it or they're gonna think it's it's still worth doing you know they're gonna be like oh i'm just gonna get spanked instead of getting like an actual like long-term punishment i guess um so the effect that the parent is trying to get out of it it will probably like wear off another con would be that the children start to hit back or that they don't care about it like stuff like that what types of spanking are appropriate and what types if any would you consider over the line I don't think that really any type of spanking is appropriate because like I said, I don't agree with it and I consider it like kind of like abusive. Um, but I guess what's okay, the way that my dad would do it is he would hit me on my hand. <laughs> so like it hurt and I would start crying, but at least I wasn't getting like beat up, you know. And crossing the line would be like excessive spanking you know i guess like spanking like once or twice gets the point across you know like you don't have to be beating down on your children because at that point it's like you just want to hit on your children you're not even you know like the point of like instilling discipline like it just goes over the parent's head like you're just hitting on your children uh after a couple hits it's just hitting um Hitting with objects, like spanking with objects, like, I know in some cultures, um, parents spank with, like, sticks or belts or, like, a sandal or stuff like that. Like, hitting with objects, I think that's crossing the line as well. Like, your hand should be enough, even though I don't, I don't condone the spanking at all. Um, at what ages is spanking appropriate? Probably, like... Honestly, I don't see any in any way that it's good because at a young age, it's like, why are you hitting a kid that, that is that, like, so young? Like, say, like, five, six, or younger. Um, because they're just a little kid, and they're learning. Like, they don't know that this is good for them. They don't know that this is bad for them. 
and as they get older it's like i don't know i feel like spanking Ch children can grow like resentment towards their parents and that they're like just gonna not want to do anything around their parents at all they, they just can cause various effects on the children what are your own experiences with spanking and do you plan to spank your children while i know um i didn't get spanked on a regular i remember that when i was in like first grade i got suspended for like writing bad words on a piece of paper and like passing around a piece of paper and i remember that i had lied about it and when i got home my mom like the voicemail from the school she heard and like she spanked the heck out of me like <laughs> she spanked me so hard but other than that that's the only thing i remember like that i got beat up like that that one time but other than that i would just get like kind of like verbal abuse just yell that um my dad would only speak me on my hand like i said and i don't plan i don't plan on spanking my children um because i don't think that's the way it's not mature and it's not to me it's not the right way to do like to get the message across to your children um i don't believe in talking like baby talk to children or treating kids any other way than like an adult like speaking wise like how you approach a, a child i guess um if you talk to them regular they're gonna they're gonna know how things are supposed to be um that's just the way i see it so i don't think that when i grow up when i become a mother i would be like superior just because i'm the mother or that i'm older or like you know how they say like well, they're elderly, elderly, they know more than you. I don't really believe in that. Like, just talk, have a normal conversation um, to a point like where they can understand it, like break it down. And I think that that will stay in their mind more than like, oh, I'm going to spank you. I don't want to do this anymore because I'm scared that I'm going to get spanked. That they, they don't want to do it because they know that it is wrong. Okay.